Hi everyone, welcome back to XCOM, and we got alien abductions, it's supposed to be modern, but whatever. So I heard you like engineers, so... Um, so my plan here is, whenever we see anything, we're gonna nuke the fuck out of it. We're gonna just take it out from orbit. Um, we got Libby here, uh, Railgun, and, uh, Lorg, whatever fucking pussycat is our main veterans here. We also have Corporal Lab. I'm also running out laser weapons, because normally I'd have someone with a laser sniper rifle. Uh, there's no snipers up right now, so I can't really do anything about that. So this person absolutely must have this. Um, I'm debating bringing along the scope. I'm debating it, but at this point, it's... I think it would be de I think it would be death, basically, basically if I did that. Um, I was debating also maybe bring along two scouts, one for sniping and the- you know, let's do that. Let's bring along two scouts then. Um, okay. So this one, this guy here, will never be in the front lines. This one will always be in the back. That's how that's gonna work. Uh, so, we're gonna marksman scope you. Like, I wanna show you what I have here. Not much. Most people are fatigued or wounded right now. We're running out of soldiers. It didn't really help the fact that we just got like three missions in a row. Uh, that's what really fucked us, actually. Um, so this one's gonna be, uh... Make items available. Because I think he, yeah, he had a laser rifle. So, oh, we have an extra heater there too. But this, this, this person's gonna be basically triggering iron, he's, this scout's gonna trigger all the iron reflexes shit that we need. Um, and my sniper here will basically be, um, well, apparently you're not black, like, the, the, the armor you're supposed to have is black, so I'll know you're fucking, yeah, there you go, that way I know you're a scout, see that, the color of them? So yeah, he's gonna be in the back, he's just gonna use his limited squad sight to basically try and shoot the fuck out of everything, like, he's gonna be my, my sniper somewhat. Um, we get two engineers to, with... Unfortunately, only one of them, I think, has uh, heat ammo. This is the support one, unfortunately. Uh, what's the other one got? I just need to know. Okay, he's got nothing, so I'd rather bring the one with the smoke grenade, I think. We got- we don't have much. I- I'm not, I'm not joking. Uh, this is tough, uh, but I think we'll pull through okay. Uh, we also have an assault uh, with us this time. So yeah, let's try it out. Hopefully. X come ho. Long War does not fuck around, I'll tell you that much. We, have visual on the mission site. we could have brought Say the shiv again. along though, but I figured I should try and level Listen some of these people. We're going to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. Current updates from the ground indicate the aliens are moving within the city limits. We should get down there and secure the area as quickly as we can. Alright. Bring her down. Put her in hover. We might be running out of here real soon. All right. Central. Big Sky in position on approach of the abduction site. Strike one is awaiting drop clearance. Copy that, Big Sky. Strike one is cleared to engage hostile targets. Watch your backs out there, people. I would like Libby to go over here. This is nice full cover there. So where is this scout that's actually going to be running ahead and, and dying? Hello, welcome to the team. Alright. Muton. Some other bullshit. All right, they're all gonna stealth mode. All right. Where's our sniper? Or uh, when I say sniper, I use the term very loosely. Yeah, we have that guy there. That's unfortunate. All right, the gunner. The gunner really should move the fuck up. Where's the gunner? I need the gunner up there. This is not a dire situation quite as of yet. This is the laser strike rifle. We're going to need that in a minute. There we go. You can only shoot that, and that's fine. Because you're going to actually sprint over here. Let's do this. Alright. Uh, let's go over here. And he's... This is our actual Overwatch one, so there's that. This is double G2X. Okay, so our sniper is gonna go right here. I want you to shoot the floater, and I want you to hit him. 
There we go. Kind of like my sniper, you know. Let's just pretend he is. All right. Uh, Squishy is our smoke grenader. Uh, so you can see we have a nice like little radius here of potential smoke grenade candidates. Uh, this is our one of our other ones. I might chuck a grenade all the way down there. Go ahead and have a look to see how our grenade situation looks like. Not excellent. That person's not going to be there, trust me. I'm a doctor. Uh, Rocketeer. Uh, Rocketeer is just going to actually sprint over here. Yes, sir. And this is our newbie guy. We're running out of cover here, not going to lie. Oh no, this is, our, this is our running gunner, actually. We could go over here and shoot that. But we risk potentially triggering more guys. But I think I'm willing to take that risk. Cause that's nice full cover there anyways. Okay. Yeah, I don't need to use your double shot yet. That was, that was simple to take down. Alright. Now where is the scout gonna run off to? Probably back here. Yeah, we'll watch that. And for this guy, we're gonna go and uh we're gonna we're gonna smoke out all of us here. So, because there is a muton there, and he's kind of threatening. Alright, here we go. Go time. We don't actually see him. What the fuck? Alright, here we go. Well, it's a good thing we have that infantry here with us. I think that Mutant just said fuck it and left. Ah, oh, here we go. We have another Overwatch shot. Ah, oh, that one wasn't gonna kill him. Honestly, this is an easy kill for some rookie, although we are in the smoke cloud. Yeah, go ahead, get a kill. Guns dry, good riddance. Guns dry, good riddance. Alright. Uh, all right. Let's have a look here. Overwatch. Uh, you can Overwatch too. I've got my eyes on. Everybody can Overwatch. Scanning. It's not Libby isn't an Overwatch gunner, but she still has advanced fire control because I gave that to her, and I also should have made him uh, reload. Okay, good stuff. He still got another shot at him. Ah, oh, there's the muton, and he's fucking off. You know, I'm I'm good with that. We didn't bring any anything to basically capture anybody. I'm just letting you know that. That isn't the plan here. The plan is mostly actually to live because this is a very tough. Uh, I I don't have I don't have many experienced people here right now. All right, there he is. And he's gonna. Okay, he's retarded, and now we're gonna kill him. Alright, he's as good as dead. So, the question is, how do we want to kill him? Uh, and who will kill him? That's another good question. Because he's just kind of there out in the open. We can even shoot him with this person. So, here's what I like to do. I like to go here first. Because this is now... There we go. We didn't trigger anybody. Why? Okay, there we go. We got two shots with this. So, let's take the two shots first. Okay, so one missed. That's okay. Um, there's an opportunity for some leveling to go on right now. And is this truck on fire? I, I okay. We're gonna move people off of this because this kind of freaks me out now. You can go over there now. <laughs> All right. So I'm gonna just go over here and I'm gonna get, assume that I have that one. Where the oh, there's the, the here's the infantry that I had before. And you kill him. Or no, this is not infantry, this is my scout. Hey, you can try and shoot him, you know what? This one's yours. Oh, good good work. You guys make me proud. They, they, they grow up so fast. Alright, we're gonna make this guy go over here. And overwatch him. Shatter Ray. I think we can go over here, but I think I'd rather kind of go... 
Uh, I need to be able to bring up the grenades and stuff. I, I am super happy that actually I have that marksman well scope. Maybe I can make it work after all, who knows. But then again, this guy is weak as fuck, so I can't use him as a anything to trigger Overwatch, so that's the problem. That's the real issue with him. Alright, we're gonna go here, Overwatch you. Uh, hello, Rocketeer, you're gonna go over here. When cars are on fire, I'm, I'm a little bit... I'm a little bit wor worried. Alright, let's see what goes on. And, nope, it's just on fire for fun. Alright, uh, there, let's see what kind of cover. We have some nice cover in some of these areas, so the gunner can definitely go over here. She's only missing one HP, so we're still good. Uh, okay, and... Sniper can go over here, easily. I'm just waiting for the nectoids to come out. Moving to position. I think I think I still had the best idea here, which Location is basically just to kind of uh, utilize people's. Uh, okay, you go reload your gun. Actually, everyone can go reload now. I'm still I still think it was a good idea to bring this many engineers because I have a, I have a feeling they're going to come in real handy very soon. All right. Yeah, they're they're up there somewhere. We know. Hopefully nothing comes from that direction. The meld is there, but I think uh, out of all our, all our priorities at the moment, meld is at the very bottom of that list. I hate to say it, but it's the truth. Uh, okay, just steady your aim with that thing. Moving to Overwatch. Uh, yeah, I'm certainly not going to have the the shotgunner overwatch, uh, trigger overwatches, I'm sorry. Alright. Because he's just going to die if it's something that, that overwatches right away. And who do we have? Nobody. Okay. We have the possibility of moving up here. This is definitely one that, that, like, I was kind of just forced to play this way. That sounds like Thin Men, actually. I like Thin Men. Oh, there's Mel that way. Eyes on the prize. Over here. Alright. I think we should move up to this truck. I like this one. We're gonna move up here. Look, this this is all full cover. Oh my god, there's no way we are not moving up here. Um, my only skeptic, I'm I'm skeptical about here because I I don't actually know what's there. So we're gonna go with the sniper, kind of up, but not too far up. It's not. Why am I calling it a sniper at all? Because it's not. Understood. It's an insult to snipers to call that a sniper. All right, and Rocketeer can go oh, pretty much over there. Rocketeer has very limited movement, but that's kind of what uh, how I built my. I kind of that's how I built them. And we got Meld there. Oh, we can go for it. And that's some language for, I have found the meld, let's fucking get it. Uh, Alright, what should I do with my shotgunner is the question. Let's move Heading over here. Now. Have a look. Okay, I think it's I think I'm, it's safe enough for me to bring the sniper up, sprint him up here. Moving to designated coordinates. I'm gonna wait just in case, okay. Moving. We're okay. The only problem with this positioning is that people, not everybody will have a line of sight on, on the en enemies that we see. Because it's very limited, like they, they have a lot of full cover blocking the way, actually. But I think I think it'll be fine once uh, once we get in there. All right, let's just go over here. Contact, and it's three mutants and some thin men too. Have a look. Okay. Nobody, none of us have shots on that. 
Uh, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to let the melt expire. I'm sorry. So let's do that. And he's he's gonna have to move somewhere else. He's gonna go back here. And it's sprinting like fashion. Oh, and th there is a thin man. And okay, he smelled the melt. I guess he I guess he preferred to do that rather than. Okay, here we go. All right. Come on, come on. Please tell me Libby you can shoot him. Thank you, Libby. Thank you. Although this is um this is not gonna crit, but I think we're gonna deal with it. Libby. You're libbying the fuck out of me. Alright, maybe we can go over here and shoot him. Yes. Yes, there we go. I'm surprised there's absolutely no crits, but it's because we're squad sighting, I think. But I know something's up. This is gonna do 8 damage. Alright, and then th now we will overwatch him. Likely killing him. All right, this guy cannot stay here uh, because of issues surrounding this. Also, your HP is really low. So, where can I move you back to? It's unfortunate about the shotgunner. It's just in a really tight space. Okay. I'm gonna have to move him over here and then hunt her down. I think I just might move him back here. Shmigum. Shmigum. I agree completely. Alright, we have some rockets, but that's just not a good... There's not enough there right now for us to make use of that, so we're just gonna overwatch. I hope they go up a little bit more, because that, that car is full cover for them, so... Uh, and he just got he just got poisoned, so... And here we have some opportunist. Oh, come the fuck on. Hey, what the hell is that floating thing? Jesus. Got in the way. He hits you, but you didn't hit him. You're useless to me. Probably gonna be another mute on there. We have no health kits, by the way. I, I forgot to mention that. I couldn't I couldn't make I couldn't make them work. Uh we have no medics, so. Incoming fire. You should be okay here. I'll just make him hunker down until the end of time. Alright, we know that there's a bunch over there. Oh, there they are. Okay, well, this makes, they just made this really easy for me. Say hello to my little friend. Probably should have shredder rocketed them, but that, that works all the same. Intimidate, intimidate, intimidate. Oh, come the fuck on. Oh, because right. she hit like three of them. That's what, that's what that does. Alright. Uh, Alright, so here's what we can do. We can either shoot and reload, or Libby can kill him. And I'd rather have Libby kill him. Because then we can reload and, uh, and do all that kind of crap. Uh, let's have a look. 70. Okay, go shoot that one. The squad site really coming into handy right now. Uh, let's see. How far can we chuck these grenades? Here's the thing, I can go over here, I can throw the grenade at the car to blow it up. Uh, risk being that he can get flanked. But it, it, it looks like it's actually telling me I'm out of range here. So I, I can still, I can do this. So he shouldn't, he can't see me, he would have to move up another square. Alright, so that car is not on fire yet. Where's my other, uh, where's my other grenader? Okay, you go here and do the same thing. Maybe, maybe with two, we will set it on fire, but we can also potentially be setting our, that car on fire, so we now cannot do that. Uh, let's have a look. What is this person? Oh, this is my old scout. And you need to reload, and then... He's gonna have to overwatch, I'm sorry. I really hope I don't lose him to something stupid, but I don't have any medkits to handle this. Okay, fortunately he's kind of moving up in a dumb place, so that's kind of nice. Uh, 
I, I, I just, I kind of need all hands on deck right now. What I might do is I might replace him with somebody else and, and move him back. And... Yeah, he's, he's hunkered down really nicely there, so... There is that. I wonder what those Mechons are going to do, though. Okay, we got another Overwatch here. Okay, good. We needed that. He's down. You're still fucking panicking. All right. We really kind of needed those rockets. Who's seeing all the, the who's seeing all those guys? Okay, so there's a thin man right there. Oh, it's it's oh yeah, it is it is my assault that's seeing all of them actually. I might just blow him the fuck out. I don't like the fact that uh, he's really close, but yeah. The thin man with a lot of HP though. Don't need that right now. Let's go over here and reload. It's killing time. Better cover there. You have no shots. Well, you know, we can potentially hit this guy, so I'm gonna try it. Well, I think we're gonna have to grenade him. Yeah, we're gonna have to grenade him. I'm on it, Commander. Let's deal with it. Oh wait, you're getting overwatched. Wow, okay. I'm under fire. You are officially out, unless you can get like a really easy kill. I really need that gunner to be honest. I have a feeling someone might die here, but on the other hand, Ready to engage. Eyes on the prize. I don't know. It's a tough one. It's a might die, because um, there's a lot of people that are a one hit away from dying, so no way that just I'm trying to let them just come into me here. Come on, get this one at least. There we go. Okay, that was the bigger threat, at least in my opinion. Bye bye. Rocketeer is going to be up this turn. Where's my assault? Oh, this guy. All right, you're going to have to go up there, and you're going to you're, you're going to have to do a little a little sight there for us. And we can actually see one of them over there. Where's the last mutant guy? I don't know. You're out of ammo, I know. Alright, so that's unfortunate that you can't actually shoot that. Well, this is actually a very good chance of killing. Alright, well, there's not much else left here. At this point, we're going to play it very safely. We're going to go up here with him and just take a shot at him. There we go. All mission objectives complete. And we got it. Yeah, that was a that was a tough one. We just had a really bad combination of people together, uh, but we managed to make it work. We didn't use the grenades as much as I thought we would, but my plan was basically if there was like a mech toy or something, just to grenade the fuck out of it. Uh, but that worked too. Uh, so Libby is our gunner that's actually doing double tap here. Um, so finally, we got her some double tap. This is our uh, just regular grenader, so heat warheads, please. Um, and this is our support one, so we can do smoke and mirrors, which is one additional use of uh, support grenades for each mission, uh, which means an additional smoke grenade as well as any any flashbangs or some things we have like that. Uh, oh, here we have our our new. Um, this is their new scout that was actually doing scout-related things. Um, so, hollow targeting. I don't know, damn good ground, it doesn't sound that bad, but even though I'm not using her as a sniper anymore, really. Well, I think I'm using scouts as snipers Remember, we will be unintentionally, but it's just kind of working out that way. Uh, let's see, aircraft boosters as a maybe. Actually, no, Bar Commander, Barks had... We've suffered a number of casualties and haven't found suitable replacements yet. We need to start hiring additional soldiers through the barracks. Well, let's see, how many do we have? We have, we have 22 out of 34. So, we have one coming in soon. Probably on like most of these missions, I'm just gonna have one fucking person. Did that, did our lot, did, did she even fucking level the last one? Become more frequent. Our casualty rate has climbed. 
Our troop shortage is becoming a problem. Yeah, we know. We start screening potential <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yes. Let's hope we don't get something else, because now I got like five. That's fucking hilarious. What did, what did that last person level up as? The rookie. Oh wait, did that rookie die? Yeah, that rookie died, didn't she? Oh, whoops. Whatever. Whatever. Fuck the police. Alright. Let's go get, um... Gray Market. Let's go get an extra upgrade in... Sector Corpses, no. Uh, I want the last officer training school thing. Here. For bonus XP. Wait, can we actually get the next one now? Damn, son. We can. Wow, we're really close to that. Okay. Well, let's go keep spinning it. Uh, 30 Illyrium uh, for fucking scientists? No. Oh, and guess what's done? This would be our fancy fucking mech lab thing. Alright, who are we gonna fucking tear apart now? The soldiers who volunteer for mech trooper augmentation sacrifice much, but they do not leave themselves entirely behind. A mech trooper will be able to apply some of the training and knowledge from his or her previous combat specialty to the cybersuit's operation. With this facility, we'll be able to build mechanized exoskeletal cybersuits, or mechs, and implant our soldiers with the cybernetic interfaces they'll need to deploy these mechs onto the battlefield. Let's make Van do that. Uh, let's see. So he's gonna become... Essentially that. Okay, we're gonna get him first, so let's just get 10 bucks to do- like, He'll be the first one that we make into a mech guy. I don't want to do too many people into mechs right now, cause, simply because I actually don't have enough, um... Uh, well, first of all, I have absolutely no idea how it works, because this is the first time I've ever done this. First of all. Second of all... So why can't this person volunteer? Oh, cause she's a lieutenant, that's why. Um, so... Yeah, so he's gonna be like I, I don't know too much about it, and I'd also rather not lose too many good people. Requisite amputations and begin installing the cybersuit interfaces as soon as possible. Review for research credits. So we have a bunch of things for research credits, which is nice. Uh, what are we doing right now? Mechtoid autopsy. All right, let's continue with that. Simply because they're really deadly. All right, we got carapace armor. Nice. It's gonna come in handy. Uh, thin man corpses for engineers. Sure. Okay. How many engineers we have to? 54. So I don't know how long that person's gonna be out for. Hopefully some people are gonna come back up. Holy shit, 450 bucks for 30 alien allies. Dude, I am deeply considering this. That's a lot of money, and I need a lot of money. One sec, let's let's have a look. That's a lot of fucking money. I, I have zero credits right now. Um I'm just looking at some of the stuff. Alloys. Ooh, I have the... Ooh, I can maybe get ammo conservation soon. Except for the fact that it would be better if I went to... Yeah, there's no way I'm going to get this in a, in a... Okay, like, I basically have to go to this country and take this over in order for me to get the bonuses for foundries. And given that Australia left the... the fucking... the council, I don't think that's going to happen anytime soon. So, believe it or not, I'm actually going to say yes, um, as much as you're probably smashing your screen, potentially. Um, simply because I'm just so short on money right now. We kind of need this. Because money has been actually one of the biggest problems for us right here. So, uh, no, well, the meld, the meld we need. I think we got enough, like, we built everything we really need at this point. Um... We'll need more eventually, I know, but yeah. Alright. The first question is what do we spend our money on? Um, let's see foundry projects. Animal conservation is a really good upgrade, but I'm still really far away from that. Uh, shaped armor is all for... Well, this is, this is potentially useful as well. Uh, oh yeah, this is also would be a really nice one, but we don't have enough alien surgery. Like those are the two best upgrades: is more ammo and shorter times for for whatever. But oh yes, I think I know what I'm gonna do actually. Re laser cannons. This is what I need to do. This will up my air game majorly, and we're gonna order another interceptor. 
Do you have... Yeah, he just has avalanche missiles. Okay. So this will be like two laser cannons in each continent. So that's what we're going to do with that. Uh, okay, mech warfare complete. That's good. Uh, yeah. Breaking news at this hour. Reports from around the globe indicate a shift in the alien phenomena now affecting cities worldwide. We're now receiving word of outright attacks. Looks like they've changed their tactics. But why? Why do this? It's a message to the entire world that nothing can stop them. be watching.